Hello and welcome back to Universal Information and Entertainment TV. Today I am going to show you that how to replace the power button on Hub and Xenu Pro drone. It's most common fault in this drone that power button does not click when you press it. Sometimes it does not turn it on and sometimes it does turn power on the drone, but it can be dangerous because it can turn off the drone while it's flying. So best idea to replace the power button with new. It can be bought from hubun.com website for cheap price. Now I am going to show you how to change this button, which is best and easy way. This is the button module which is showing on screen. You need to have just two Phillips screwdrivers, a blade and scrapper to take apart on this drone to replace this button. First of all remove the top plastic cover as showing on screen using a blade. Now just pick the power button's plastic, because it's just placed on the body. You will see the two Phillips type screws, unscrew these two screws then place them on a side. Remove the battery if it's in the drone. Now remove the gimbal cover. Now you will see two screws are behind the gimbal and one screw in front of gimbal. Please remove all three screws. and then carefully remove the gimbal protectors from front and back. On the bottom of drone there are two more screws. Please unscrew these two screws. Put the drone flat and use a sharp tool-like blade's corner to remove the adhesive tape from its front arms as showing. and two more plastic covers from arms with blade as showing. As you can see that two more screws are appeared, Please unscrew these two screws and carefully remove the white plastic holders, which are holding the drone's arm. Now remove the top cover with care as showing. The top cover has some cable connections with short wires on its left side. Remove top cover as showing with extra care.
Flip over the drone to remove the screws if you are not using magnetic screwdriver. Carefully fold the top cover as showing. Now you can see the power button module which is screwed by two Phillips screws. Remove first screw. Then remove the cable connector, with using a flat type of tool with lifting it up, as showing but please do it with extra care. Now it's time to remove the second screw, which was hidden under the cable connector. Please unscrew the this screw. Now remove the power button from drone then replace with new module. Place the new power button module on its place then put the two screws back to hold it properly as showing. After this process please put the connector back to power button module. It's very simple. Just place it on its right place then push it firmly until you hear a little click, and you should feel it's solid connected as it should be. Now put the battery pack into drone to test it to make sure that the power button is working properly. Press and hold the power button as showing. The drone should turn on as normal. Now turn it off by press and hold the power button again. Now please follow the reverse steps to pack it up. Please carefully put the gimbal protector back to its original position. Please keep watching this remaining video to make sure that you are following right steps. I will show you results after reassembling this drone at the end of this video.
As you can see on screen that drone has been reassembled successfully. I am just turning it on by pressing the power button. The drone is turning on and gimbal is adjusting the camera nicely. That's it. Job is done. Enjoy. Thanks for watching Universal Information and Entertainment TV. Please like and subscribe our channel for more updated videos, news, information and entertainment. See you in next video. Stay tuned.